Um, I think I had the perception that it was all people who were just in incredible, in incredible shape. They had tons of fitness experience that, um, you know, literal athletes that were in the prime shape of their lives and just incredible human specimens. And uh, I quickly learned that, you know, it's people of all different fitness backgrounds, levels of experience, all shapes and sizes. Yeah, it's a lot more diverse than I expected. Finding out that I can do things that I didn't think that I could or wasn't aware that I was able to. Um, being in a group and you know the, the whole group environment is, is really motivating and encouraging as well. Um, so the, the support and encouragement of, of everyone around me and just knowing that Everyone's in a different place on their fitness journey, and it's not a competition with other people. Um, you know, you're the only one that you should be competing with. The only person you should be competing with is yourself. I just want to look better naked. <laughs> you know, um, I want to get stronger. Uh, I want to get faster. I just want to feel better. I want to like what I see when I look in the mirror, and I want to feel great when I wake up in the morning and it's a gradual process with all of those things. So. <laughs> when I moved to Texas, it was in the middle of my eighth grade year, and I had a broken wrist, and I literally missed rope climbing day in gym class because I had a cast on my arm and wasn't able to participate. And so I never had the opportunity to try and climb a rope. So I, I was about six months into my journey here after I joined CrossFit Round Rock and it was rope climbing day. My first thought was <laughs> great. My first thought was uh, that I was in deep trouble and uh, and then realized that, you know, I'm stronger than I thought I was and I can accomplish more than I anticipated. And um, once I was shown the proper way to climb a rope, I was able to get up there and ring the bell. and. Um, yeah, it's a pretty cool feeling. I guess the advice that I would give somebody thinking about joining CrossFit would be to, to remove all of the preconceived notions from your head that you have about CrossFit. Um, it can be whatever you want it to be. You can tailor every workout to your experience level, your strength level. It's really designed to just be whatever you make of it and it's a lot less intimidating than I first thought it would be. Um, especially an organization like CrossFit Round Rock, you know, walking in here and being welcomed the way that, that I was and sort of led through the initial phases of you know, making sure I was familiar with the movements and the nomenclature and, and all of that um, was really helpful. I think that I've developed a little bit more self-confidence. Um, I've got more faith in myself that if I set lofty goals that I'm able to accomplish them. I've got people who I know I can count on if I need anything. Um, people who truly care about my well-being. Um, and a place that I know that I can go if I'm having a rough day or just not feeling myself, I know that there's a place I can go and be around good people and escape for a little bit and uh, feel better at the end of the hour. It's hard to choose one thing that I like about the community. There's a lot that, um, that goes into why this is the only thing that's been able to keep me consistent with a workout regimen through my, throughout my entire life. The camaraderie and the encouragement I think is my favorite part about the community. Um, if I miss a day or two, there's people blowing up my phone. Where are you? Are you okay? You know, knowing that I'm obviously not going to be at the same level as everybody else that's here, but knowing that those same people are encouraging me to accomplish whatever it is that is appropriate for me.